How's it going, everyone? I'm Nostalgic Dave, and welcome back aboard the Nostalgia Train. Eventually. Eventually, I will get a soundboard. Things will change then. In the meantime, let's go into Hamelin. Okay. And let's go talk to Prince Moccasin. If people will let me through. Yes, travel to Hamelin. And this is the way. Boom. <laughs> what the? It's such a very enthusiastic. Boo. Hey, hey, bra. Hey, hey, bra, bra. Guess what? Boom. <laughs> a bit too early for a joke of the episode, isn't it? That looks a bit more, at least, realistic. Or a bit more natural. Seeing these guys with their pig heads earlier in the game felt really... Strange, to say the least. I love the design of this room, too. Like, I know I probably said this earlier on, but jeez, just look at this place. It's so gorgeous! Anyway. Yeah, I got, I got, I... I don't know. Hey, Markson. Guess what, your princess? We got them all. We got all them stones. You have Mornstar's magic stones? So you recovered the map from Kablai? That's right, your highness. Well, I... Uh, uh, sorry, my knee hit the table and everything went... Well, actually, he kind of gave it to us. Kablai helped you? The Sky Pirate. He's not a bad sort. Once you get to know him, he took us under his wing, like... Even gave us a dragon to fly about on. Daddy, eh? He... He gave you a dragon. Can this be true? It's true, your highness. Tengri helped us fly... Find the three magic stones. We couldn't have done it without him. The problem now is how to stick the stones back into Monster. And I won't lie to you. We don't have the foggiest. We were kind of hoping you might be able to help us, your highness. Please, give me the wand and the stones. I wish to examine them. Okay. Hmm. This is rather a tricky one. I'm going to back up a little bit. I shouldn't have scooted forward in the first place. With the, all the wobbling, the wobbliness should have given away. Don't scoot forward. Oh, uh, don't tell me you can't help us either. The stones are just too big, aren't they? Well, for a mere matter of unifying the sizes of the wand and the stones, my powers are more than suffice. But I am afraid it is not only their dimensions that are out of alignment. There's another problem. One that I lack to... I lack the ability to resolve. Hang on a minute. Are you telling us it ain't just the wonky sizes we have to worry about? It's never flipping easy, is it? I think I've got it. Just think for a moment. When exactly did we get hold of oh, time? One's older than the other. Age. It was when we were sent back to the past. Which means, um, the problem may stem from attempting to join the Mornstar of 15 years past with the stones you obtain here in the present. Makes sense. As long as there is this time difference, so to speak, it may not be possible to unite them. So, we need to find Mornstar here in the present? If only it were that simple. I had my men search for it, but it seems it has been destroyed. Not a trace of it remains in our time. Hold on. We brought it with us from the past, so surely it makes sense that it doesn't exist in the present as well? Oh, I see what she said. I was confused for a split second. You, you, 
Hun, you got it. You know what? You got it, girl. Boom. <laughs> All right. I get what she's saying, though. Basically, since we brought one physical part of it from the past, it can't all... A second one... A second one can't exist in the present since the past one is now in the present. Oh, yeah. Wait. What? I just explained it, Oliver. Hold on, hold on. This is all getting a bit too flippin' complicated for me. There may be one who can help you. I speak of Kulan, of the four great sages. Her magical powers were the most formidable. So, if we can find the great sage Kulan, she can help us with Morinstar? Because it's going to be that simple. Always is, isn't it? Why do I keep looking over here? I literally need to move the camera to my right, your left. We were talking about Kulan, the queen of the heavens, right? She ruled a city in the clouds called Xanadu, but that place was destroyed. Yes. Jeepers! Her city was destroyed? Could it really be five years ago? Yes, it must be. Five years ago, news reached us that Shadar had attacked the celestial citadel of Xanadu. Okay, hey, then. That does not sound like happy fun times at all. By the time we met, we mustered our forces, it was too late. When Hamlin's airborne divisions arrived, Xanadu had been wiped from the map. I'm afraid I do not know what became of its queen and her subjects. But perhaps, if you are lucky... Bah! Fat chance. It sounds like Shadaw dealt with them uh, just like he dealt with your predecessor. Swain, please. In any case, it is not within my power to help you. For that, I can only apologize. Don't worry, Your Majesty. There must be another way. Well, if we can't find Kulan, I guess we'll have to try another great sage. Another? Well... Alicia is no longer with us, which leaves only Rashad. Yes, my father is sure to know something. Your father? Ah, now I see where you get your wisdom. Yes, Rashad may well be able to help you. Cool. <laughs> Thank you, Your Majesty. <laughs> We're not going to find anything out by hanging around here. Swapping compliments. Let's be off, shall we? Sure. Let's go find somebody who can help us. They're out there somewhere. I just know they are. Very confident, aren't you? I actually almost forgot about this thing when I was like, where am I going? There. Gosh. Look at it. Was it just me or did something just flash on the screen? That's not the type of armor you find around these pots. There's no snout for starters. Hmm? There's something strange about her. Hold on! Could she be... What is it, Swain? Is she a friend of yours? <laughs> yeah, we go way back. <sighs> but seriously, it's that armor she's wearing. It's what they wore in Xanadu. You what? But I thought Xanadu was destroyed. So she's a survivor, is it? That's lucky. Come on, Ollie. Come on, Ollie boy. Let's find out what our girl's got to say for herself. You're talking as if it's a bad thing. Hi. Oh. Pale. Silent. Glowing. I reckon you're going to need to use a spell if you want to have a chat with this one, are boy? Gee, I wonder what spell I might need. Eh? Uh, nope. 
Where is it? Ah. Uh, boom. <laughs> can it be? Can you? Can you see me? Of course we can. Oh, that's Swain. Never mind. That sounds like something that Drippy would say, though. Of course we can. Why wouldn't we be able to? Oh, this is marvelous! You can hear me, too. Sure we can hear you. But if we're using spirit medium to speak to you, it must mean... You were correct. I lost my life some time ago. You were the first to notice my presence. Well... We weren't going to miss you in that kitab, were we? So you came from Xanadu, did you? Indeed. The celestial kingdom of Xanadu was my home. I was charged with protecting our queen. But Shadara destroyed Xanadu, didn't he? So I guess you... Um... No, I did not fall in battle. I was... I was slain by a comrade. A fellow citizen of Xanadu. Huh? What do you mean? What you said was correct. Shadar did indeed lay waste to my home. The fiend made his way into the inner sanctum of the palace, unnoticed by anyone. Our magic had no effect on him. Even the mighty sorcery of Queen Kulan was, un was useless. Kulan? But we heard she had the most powerful magic of all the great sages. Nonetheless, it was of no use. She too was powerless against him. But Shadar did not take our lives. No, he robbed us of something else. He stole our hearts. He took the hearts of all who dwelt in our city. He, he stole all of your hearts? Indeed, and without hearts to call our own, we lacked emotion. We lacked reason. That was how it came to pass that... Duh! You said enough. We can imagine what happened then. Believe me. Shadar will pay for this. What happened that day, I will never forget. Its horror is forever etched in my memory. That's so horrible. To be killed by one of your own people? I... I'm so sorry. Do not pity me. My people still have hope. Hope? What do you mean? Queen Kulan, the Queen of the Heavens. She lives still. Huh? She does? We thought that... Now that I dwell in the spirit realm, I can feel her presence. I can sense my queen's power. For years, I have searched for her without cease. But she is not to be found in this kingdom. I sense her presence somewhere to the north of here. But I sense something else too. An evil so terrible... I fear to approach it. North of here? Do you mean the Tombstone Trail? Hmm, maybe. Time was, there were other kingdoms on this continent. Now there's only Hamelin. And the odd town or two. But if she's out there, we have to find her. We've got Tengri. If the Queen of the Heavens is somewhere around here, we're sure to find her. Do you mean it? Do you really mean to search for her? You have my eternal gratitude. Don't worry, ma'am. We won't let Shinara get away with what he's done. And besides, we have our own scores to settle with, the fiendish scoundrel. Fair enough. Oh, stop trying to impress her by sounding all heroic. What he means to say is leave it to us. Also, excuse me, I just burped. Why? Who would do that? Excuse me, I just burped. Hey! <laughs> Boom! <laughs> Who would do that? I thank you most humbly. I am deeply grateful. Ah, I almost forgot. Should you find Queen Kulan, or any other survivor from Xanadu, would you give them this? It was damaged by the fire that swept through our realm, but it is the only remaining proof that my city... And indeed myself ever existed. Sure, leave it to us. You obtained the wings of Xanadu. That's enough chit chat for now. It's time to scour Atomnia and see if we can find Queen Kula. Now, 
Before doing this, I remember struggling at a specific level the last time I went there, so I want to check for something. Oops, that was the wrong button. Good job, me. Anyway, this. Uh, can I get the Medal of Valor anywhere? Hmm. Actually, I might swap. What am I doing? This. Cool. Well, that up the ante for you. Um. Anyway, let's get. Hey, punk. Yes, let's get out of here. Why am I traveling like this? Well, too late now. Where's the exit? I spin me round, right, round, right, round, like a record, baby, right, round, round, round. Actually, that's something I need. I So the discussion in video you guys see earlier today, I talked about that, and I found it very interesting. Okay. So if I remember correctly... One place I went to help me get some experience. Um, well, right here actually isn't the best. There's a, there is where we need to go, right there. You could grind for experience here, technically. But I don't know if there's much benefit to that. Where is everyone? Power stone. Cool, man. Wait. Can I upgrade anything? Yeah, those two are obviously my most beneficial thingamajigs. Anyway, that's not what I was looking for. I got 72 chocolate bars. I want to see... Huh. I wonder. Well, first of all... Fight me! And spells. Burn! You... Didn't burn. Oh, your weakness is light. Okay. Dead. Give me they. Give me them. Give me them egg rolls. Give me them egg rolls, boy. Hey, boom! You dead. No, ah, you suck. Wait. You're not weak to light. What are you weak to? Ice? Wait, did I hit you with the right spell? Oh. You're strong against dark. Why is it the one type of spell I don't have yet? That's what you're weak to. Nice and dead. We did it! We did it! Oh boy. Um. 
to see if there's anything I can do. Is there anything I can't... Oh, hold on. Hold up. Hold up. I'm going to look up a recipe really quick. So, double checking on a couple things. I want to make sure I can actually, you know, power up it all. Um, might be going back to you all for a bit. Possibly. Let's go in here first. Just to activate the area. Hi. Who goes there? Oh, I see. You are not from these parts. I don't think so. Yeah, not from here. <laughs> How very observant of you. Listen, we'd love to stay and chat, but we've got things to do. This town has been blessed by a higher power. I cannot allow the likes of you to disturb the tranquility of such a sacred place. Gee, sorry, mister. I didn't know. We're not here to disturb anything. Talk about a warm, flippin' welcome. This miserable so-and-so do with some lessons in hospitality from my dear old man. Cease your senseless witterings. I will not let you pass. Be gone. I have important matters to attend to. Sacred ceremony is about to begin, and Queen Kulan will not be kept waiting. Hang on. Did you just say Queen Kulan? It's her we're after. Aha! Just as I thought. You intend to harm our queen. Oh, wow. Way to jump to conclusions, buddy. Well, you shall not do what so while I draw breath. No, you've got it all wrong, mister. We just want to speak to her. Somebody told us she was still alive. The person who gave us this medal. But, but how? Tell me, where did you find this? We met a lady in Hamelin. She was wearing armor just like yours. Can it be? Is she still is she here now? No. She said she wouldn't travel north. I reckon she had enough on her plate already. What with her being dead and all. But this can it be true? Can she really be gone? Seems our friend here and that mystery woman have some history. Feared she had not escaped. But I cannot allow my feelings to come before my duty. Tell me, what business have you with the queen? There's something we need to ask her. I see. Well, I will let you pass. But I am afraid you may be out of luck. What? You mean we can't see Queen Kulan? I fear she will have no time for you now. Did I not say that she is preparing to preside over the sacred ceremony? Uh, I... Surprisingly, I don't remember. Okay, that's not much of a surprise to those who know me, but... Yeah, to everyone else, it's a surprise. Boom! <laughs> that's perfect time to do that. Then there's me re-watching this video, just like... That's, all, that's the only response I'm giving myself. Oh, shoot! I don't think I read that. Is that... Is that Queen Kulana there? Well, over... There? Is that Kulan? Perdita, the Lost Land. Isn't Perdita the name of an actual air location IRL? I don't know. Maybe. Well, first off, before doing anything... Jump into the door. That's what we need to do next. Hi. Well, you thought I forgot about you? Welcome to one of the cat's cradle chain of premium inns. We pride ourselves on a practical in pricing. Can I just go back to Ding Dong Dell and do this instead? We don't get an awful lot of visitors up here in Pradita. Ever since Queen Kulan brought her blessings to this place, a guard has stopped anyone entering the town. It's all a little peculiar. Look, Oliver, your wizard's companion's filling up. 
that'll be the memories of the folks who stayed here, I reckon. Eh? That page ain't even about this town. What the heck is that? What is that home? Xanadu? Huh. That one... Okay. Not yet. Nope. I trust you had another perfect night's sleep at the cat's cradle. Travel safely now. Uh... Thanks. I want... Excuse me. I don't know how to interact with things. You obtained a patty cake. Baker's man. Boom me a cake as fast as you can. Ugh. If you shoot the cake and then give it to me, I'll be like, why did you give this to me? Okay. So. Oops. What is this going to impact? Did that do anything? I feel like that did absolutely nothing. Sure. Um... Oh, hello. I'm doing my best to try to avoid what's coming next, to, if I'm being honest. I don't like the battle that's coming up. Hi! No bounty hunts. I forgot that... Hi. Well, might as well talk to you. Since we're already here. Uh, spirit medium. Hi. Ah, it's you, Ollie. You must have a lot of time on your hands to climb all the way up here. Well, we had a dragon to take us here. Must have been tough for you, though, huh? Hardly. One of the great things about being a ghost is that I can go pretty much anywhere. Anyway, take a look at the words on this board here. They're writing in funny letters, aren't they? Those are from the Sagely Stone Age. This town is so remote that there are still traces of those times here. Blimey! I can't make head nor tail of that wonky writing. I suppose they don't. They do look a little, a bit like Nazcan. Now that I think about it. Maybe you're not as stupid as you look, Pipsqueak. They're actually based on Nazkin runes. And speaking of Nazkin, it's been a while since I gave you something to decipher. If you look through the chapter called Regions of the World in your Wizard's Companion, you'll find bits of Nazkin here and there. There's a certain character that only appears in one location. My question is, where is it? Don't worry. This one isn't as hard as it sounds. Well, not quite. <laughs> when you work it out, let me know. Here, I'm going to do some digging. I'll be back once I'm done. So I looked through the book, and I think I got it. I keep pushing the wrong button. I keep pushing circle instead of triangle. <clears throat> You worked it out yet, Ollie? Let me give you the question again. If you look through the chapter called Regions of the World in your Wizard's Companion, you'll find bits of Nazkin here and there. There's a certain character that only appears in one location. The question is, where? He only appears in a place called Jabal al Dukan, I think is how you say that. Here, I'm just going to put it in. I've actually never done these before, so I'm a bit shocked at how well I'm doing at this. If anybody's confused on why I'm not showcasing the actual, like, searching, 
Trust me, you don't want to see how long it took me to search for this. I'm bl as blind as a bat sometimes. <laughs> You got it, Ollie! Each area marked on the maps corresponds to a number written in Naskin. Actually, I noticed that for like a split moment that I'm like, and a bit of it. And the only character that appears once is the six, next to Jabal al Dukan. <sighs> Looks like you're really getting to know your way around the Wizard's Companion. I think that deserves a reward. Veil. Gee, thanks, Horace. I'm sure it'll come in real handy. Oh, can I ask you something? Do you know anything about a little island that has a monument with Naskin writing on it? Off in the sea to the west of the fairy ground it is. Do you know the one we mean? West of the fairy ground? Hmm. Oh, I think there was a big battle there during the Wizard Wars. But I'm sure there used to be a much bigger island there. Where can this new one have sprung from? Well, Mama always told us fairies she made all the islands around by that. Maybe she wasn't talking out of her hat after all. Really? So the fairy's mum can do creation magic? Interesting. Eh? You really reckon she was fibbing? Ha! <laughs> There's more to my old mum that meets the eye. Hold on a minute. How do you know all this? Hmm? How? I, um... That's a good question. I don't remember. You sure do an awful lot, Horace. I'll bet there isn't a single thing you don't know about the Wizard's Companion. Just what? Just what's your story, mum? How come you know all about the dim and distant past? I told you, Pipsqueak. I'm the Sage of Ages. That's not a flippin' answer. Actually, it is an answer, Trippy. Boom! <laughs> that was more like a comeback boom rather than just a generic... Boom! <laughs> that's what... No, that's what it should have been. Boom! Hee-hee! <laughs> I don't know anymore. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> but it's all I can remember. I'm Horace, the Sage of Ages. Beyond that, your guess is as good as mine. You really can't remember? I was certain that traveling the world would help bring back more of my memory. But now I'm not so sure. Sometimes I feel like it's all coming back to me. But then it goes again. Right back where I started. Ugh, who cares? What matters is that I can go wherever I like and see whatever I please. Why fret about a little thing like losing my memory? I guess so. I mean, as long as you're sure you're happy, I'll be fine. And if I do remember something, you'll be the first to know. I'll be waiting back where we first met. Bye for now. I am very tempted to go there just for the sake of avoid. Thank you for telling me where you're going to be next. I am very tempted to go back over there just to avoid the incoming task at hand. So let's do it. I am avoiding every little possible progression thing. Plus, I mean, what, we're at like 35 minutes now? Where are we? I was close. 34 minutes. I wonder, is he over here? Is he over here again? However, I wonder, is he actually going to be over at the exact spot we first met him? I have a hard time believing that. Because that ain't him. That ain't him. Maybe he is. As I've said before, I've never helped Horus this much. I might even be wrong about assuming that he's even here right now. Maybe you have to progress first. 
I don't know. I'll give him a little boom finger if he's actually there, though. <laughs> I'll give it to myself. I'll just be like, and I'll say it. Ow! That felt really weird. Hold on. Okay, there we go. There we go. Ah, okay. Yeah, there it is. He's not there, is he? Because this is where we first met him. Yeah, he ain't there. I think you have to progress a little bit first. Okay, that's fine. It's good to know, though. But I do want... I, I, You know what? I am very, very, very tempted to do whatever I can to avoid the incoming circumstances. I really don't want to progress, because I know what's going to come in, and I'm not... I The last time I played the game, I struggled with this. I've played this game a few times as well, and I always struggle with this. I honestly have no idea why I do. It's very interesting, to say the least. So, let's go ahead and head out here. And... Yeah, they're gonna be running for me. I'm not aiming to fight those guys. I think they're supposed to be like this monster or something. Can you even go down there at all? Apparently you can, and I just didn't notice. Oh, man. Oh, buzz off. Buzz off! Wasn't there supposed to be, like, a forest or something nearby? Is it over here? Ah, there it is, there it is, there it is. Okay, cool. What is that thing? What is that thing, anyway? No, yeah, okay, fine. I obviously can't avoid... <sighs> as much as I'd love to avoid doing this, I can't. I mean, maybe I can. I don't know. If I can, then I'm unaware of it. But first, before stopping... Oh, hello. How can I help you today? Um... What does this do? Tricky type intensifies... Right, amber-colored scales that give their web wearer more control over the forces. Forces. Yes. Equip it on. Yeah, definitely. Because I know for a fact that the next boss that I have to fight, weak to light, which may should make that a bit stronger actually. Jeez. Oh, Why was that not equipped in the first place? Do you have anything better? You've got nothing for me. I 
Actually, do you, what weapons do you got? I keep going back and forth because I'm not sure. And I know for a fact that this guy's probably going to use this. I'm trying to upgrade as much as I can. Actually, sell. I know, I know. Okay, that's what I figured. I'm assuming the rest of them are equipped. Let's, uh... I'm going to equip as much as possible. However, while I'm doing this, I'm probably going to take care of some grinding and some other stuff so we don't have to worry about too much. But for right now, I am going to leave this video here. Let's go rest up real quick. Wait, what is this? That's fire. Fire purdy. <laughs> I'm going to leave this video here while I go rest. So, thank you guys so much for watching this episode of Nino Kuni Wrath the White Witch Remastered. If you liked it, Bang that like button and so far you can't see it anymore. That made perfect sense. I swear it. I did the wrong thing again. Wait, I can't spring lock this one? Well, boo. That's a purple one. Okay, fine. Thanks for watching this video, guys. If you liked it, push that like button and so far you can't see it anymore. And if you really liked it, consider subscribing to the channel. If you have a suggestion for a game by the Bandai Namco or Level 5 that you'd like to see on here, let me know in the comments below. Or if you want to check out one I've done prior to this, this is really only one at this point, but click the link down there. I only did part of it because I wasn't, I kind of lost interest over time, but uh, check the playlist out itself. Uh, and we'll go ahead and the train will take you over there. If you want to check out any of the stops you might have missed on this ride, click the link across my head here and the train will take you there. In the meantime, this train's off to its next destination, but we hope to catch you guys in another ride. Bye!